um, in a multicultural and, and equal society. Um, what are your feelings about um, the ability to choose the sex um, of a child and possibly um, allowing people to abort fetuses um, of, their, um, of, of the sex they, did, they didn't want? Yes, there are two questions coupled together, in mm. fact. In the first case, I think, according to the Holy Quran, as I understand it, there is no harm whatsoever in trying to have a male baby instead of a female baby or a female baby instead of a male baby. I don't see a single verse which prevents this. On the contrary, it has long been practiced right from the time of Hazrat Rasulullah to have access to such medicines which would help uh, you achieve your purpose of creating, of, 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 of having a male or female child. So if medicine, usage of medicine was not against religion, how genetic material, uh, tempering the genetic material or tempering the wrong word, but I mean treating the genetic material to achieve your purpose could be wrong. Not at all. It should not be considered wrong. Recently, again in America, they guarantee the sex which you require, male boy or female boy, by treating your own uh, reproductive material. X chromosome or Y chromosomes are the main issue. They remove some altogether from the semen and uh, then they can guarantee 100 percent that the other sex will be born. Mm. So things are being done and these were also very expensive but I have no religious objection against it because as I have already said in the Holy Quran there is no mention of not choosing, trying to choose your sex. But uh, as far as the abortion is concerned, there I hold my independent, not independent views, my views based on the Quran, that whenever a child is, uh, has taken birth, in, no, 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 not birth, when a child has been conceived, whether it has, it has achieved its own independent life during the fourth and a half, four and a half months time, or whether it has not, this is irrelevant. The question is, if it has been conceived, then for the reason of sex, you cannot abort it, according to the Holy Quran. For the reason of saving the life of the mother, yes. For other reasons which are disputed, if the child is distorted, and you know it, this is a disputed a grey area of discussion. Mm. But as far as uh, abortion of a healthy embryo is concerned, the Holy Quran does not permit it for any other reason than the ones I mentioned. Thank you. Right?